Now, obviously, you both are such great storytellers, so I thought it'd be fun to put your skills to the test with a little game called Lie and Tell. Oh. Here's how this works. Brett, Rosanna, and I are going to take turns picking up a card with a random word on it from this pile. We'll then have to tell a story for about 30 seconds about that word. And after time is up, the other two will guess whether that story was true or a complete lie. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, I'll go first. I'm going to set the standard, okay? <clears throat> Look at the word. <clears throat> so we're okay, okay. Okay. guessing if, I'm if being... it's true or yes, lying. Exactly. Uh -oh. We guess. Okay. okay, my word is airport. Just okay. so we know, okay? My word okay. is airport. <clears throat> um, I travel a lot, so I'm in a lot of airports. Um, okay. One of my, yeah, that's right. <laughs> one of my uh, least favorite things is checking in bags at airports because they get lost or they get damaged or something. Um, and this is why I don't like black suitcases because they all look the same. So one time I landed and I took a suitcase. I, I didn't check the tag or anything. I took it home thinking it was mine. I don't unpack my own stuff. Um, my assistant does and it was full of not one, not two, but it had three vibrators and it wasn't mine. Oh, like, that's <laughs> true. That's got to be true. That happened. That's. It was my suitcase. <laughs> uh, true. False! <laughs> I wish, I wish that happened. Liar! That I is wish. so funny. Thank you. That's Thank great. You. That's what I do, I lie. Okay, yeah, me here we too. go. You ready? Okay, yeah. What's the word you got? Okay. What's the word? Lawnmower. Okay, cool. Um, so. I was caddying Liar. once okay. <laughs> at this country. It was a horrible job. Mm -hmm. And not like, because you're like, you're working like for the worst people, you know, these like rich white guys who are like, you know, <laughs> <laughs> just like made a call and like had like 20 people killed or something like that. Uh, but like corporate, not like criminals, you know? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I mean, like, I respect gangsters, you know what I mean? <laughs> anyway. I like had like a bunch. I was eating, but the caddies were also like horrible. They were just like just like scum, and uh, I remember that I like got a bunch of napkins, and and then this guy was like, "Oh, you got a bunch of napkins? This is because like, you're a Jew. Jew. Jews love lots of napkins." <laughs> <laughs> He's right. Uh, <laughs> we do, but it still offended me. It still offended me. I think the word was lawnmower. <laughs> Oh, because I was thinking like grass, like on a golf course. <laughs> and they like, you know, they mow it. There's a lot of grass on a golf course, right? <laughs> it's not like it's not like concrete. I'm gonna I'm gonna Never guess seen... that's false. What do you think, Rob? I think false. It's true. <laughs> Someone said Jews like napkins? Yeah. Isn't that weird? That's so weird. I know. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I wonder where that guy is now. He's not on the show, I'll tell you that. <laughs> All right, Rose. He's not wearing yellow socks. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> Sorry. Let's Last go, Rose. one. Let us know your word. Okay, it's cupcake. Okay, you ready? Okay, here's my story. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I meet a guy on MySpace. <laughs> And I think it's going to be a really cute date because I don't want to, you know, be alone with him right away because he's on. I met him on MySpace. So yeah. I thought, invite him over to my house with all my girlfriends. Yeah. In college, I lived with a ton of girls. I lived in the cheer house. There was a bunch of us. Uh -huh. And I said, let's bake together. That's so cute. Mm -hmm. We're going to make cupcakes. We're going to bake. And then we're, we went out to dinner. Mm -hmm. And it was a disaster. The conversation was terrible. And at the end of the night, he practiced this sleazy routine where he's driving the car, he parks, and then he flips a little lever on my seat and he jumps over and like jumps on top of me and then like pushes it back. And he's like, wasn't that a great night? And I was like, I really have to be honest, I'm not feeling this. And I just kind of like grab the door, you know, like the handle, and I just kind of slink out. Just, like, so, and I, Cupcakes. I'm like, don't do that for a first date. That was a weird, Ooh. just a okay. kind of event. I love how like dark both of our stories yeah. are. <laughs> yeah. They're really Morbid. dark. You were almost. What dark. do you think, Brett? True or false? I think, oh. it's, I think it's. I think it's true. I I don't want it to be true I don't because want, it's want it gross. To be, well, yeah. But I think it's true. <laughs> I don't think you have the ability to lie. I don't think I, you can lie. I never did a MySpace date. 
date after that. That was my first and last. Never again. My, you can date on MySpace? This is a long time ago. Yeah, I went I don't, on one. I mean, listen, it's kudos terrible. to you. It's terrible. It's the worst. She did the same thing to me <gasps> in the car. She was Just like, kidding. <laughs> in New York, there was no car. That's all the time we have for Lion Tell.